Welcome to ETV for May 26, 2010. Airline officials are trying to figure out how a sleeping passenger was left aboard a flight for four hours after it landed in Philadelphia. According to police and the Transportation Security Administration, the passenger didn't wake up when her flight landed shortly after midnight Tuesday. At about 4 a.m., a cleaning crew found her. United Airlines says they're working with a regional partner carrier to determine why the plane wasn't cleared upon landing. UW-Madison police arrested a 21-year-old UW-Madison student for allegedly setting fires in dumpsters in the university-owned vehicles early Tuesday morning, police said. The fires were reported between 2.30 a.m. and 4.30 a.m. Two fires were in trashville dumpsters and two were set in the university-owned vehicles. All library books and fines are due in the library by Friday of this week. There will be a volleyball meeting for students interested in going out for volleyball for next year in the auditorium on June 1st. 3.05 p.m. Attention all football players. We'll be having our organizational meeting Wednesday, May 26 at 2.49 in Coach D's room. Bring a pen and or pencil. Please arrange transportation as the meeting may go past 3.30. You will be able to make practice, although it will be late. We'll be covering Get Fast, Camp, and Expectations. Any student interested in Get Fast for the summer, we will be having an organizational meeting on June 2nd at 2.49 in the high school auditorium. We will be done by 3.25. This will be the time to sign up for the session you want. We are raising the bar to earn a t-shirt, so be a part of that challenge. Remember, you can earn a fourth credit for an elective by completing the class. In sports, Boys Varsity has WIAA regionals tonight. We got a chance to talk to Chelsea Hayes about the yearbook party. Seniors, sophomores, and freshmen will be dismissed at certain times. Seniors at 2.30, juniors at 2.40. The sophomores at 2.50 and freshmen at 3 o'clock. And everyone will meet in the commons and be able to sign yearbooks and talk and mingle. And they will also be allowed to buy Sharpies. We have three different colors, black, blue, and silver for the senior pages because they are black. And you can buy those for 75 cents while you're getting your yearbook. All right, thank you. Thank you for watching ETV for May 26, 2010. Have a nice day, Austin.